Hello and welcome to Easy Drupal. If you remember in a couple of our previous videos, uh, I showed you that I'd got this error here, which is telling me that there's a security update for my version of Drupal. Basically, that means that there's a later version of core Drupal available and that you should update. It may also be that there are some modules that need updating. So I'm going to very quickly show you how to do that today. It's ever so easy if you've set your site up in the way that I've shown you using Composer. So let's dive straight in and I'll get into the command line and show you how it's done. OK, so from our VS Code command line, we open up a terminal, which is what I've got here. So the first command is to open up our Docker command line. Obviously, you do have to have the Docker container running for this to work. So this takes us straight into the root of our Drupal site, which if you look at the previous videos, you'll see how we set those up. I'll link to those down below. And really, it's a very simple command, which is composer update. This will get all of the latest core Drupal and update it, and also any modules that need updating that have uh, significant versions. Hit that. Okay, that's completed. You can't see because of my face. I was in the wrong place. There was a, one error where it had a connection timeout. So let's just run it again just to make sure that we definitely got everything. Yeah, all up to date. Good. Okay, that is it. Um, there is one more step which we need to do, and this is to run the update DB. After adding any module or doing any major updates, you should always run update DB which you run with Drush. And the short code is updb. I do have a couple of errors there. I keep, I've got some old modules uh, called Blazy and Slick, which I need to remove. So I will do that. OK, so I did have one or two errors there, which I'll investigate. But as it's only my local development environment, I'm not too worried about that. But the module updates have been done. So it's updated. So these are the name of the updates here. And they've completed com successfully. OK, that's it for this one. Very easy to do. Uh, do it locally before you do it on your main site, just to check uh, that everything's OK. But uh, yeah, using Composer, very easy. Thanks for watching. See you soon.